I need you guys to check the big four bridge about this shooting I just got. The first calls just after nine. You got multiple people attempting uh, first aid right now. It was just really traumatizing to see like, it's just, it's too much. It's becoming too often every day. Jaleel Hester witnesses a tragedy he says is too common. This time, five teens shot near the base of the Big Four Bridge on a crowded Saturday night. We were coming down to walk the bridge, and like, like it was such a like a regular day. It was so cool. The next thing you know, I'm seeing like the police cars race down the street. All five victims treated at U of L Hospital with some experiencing life-threatening conditions. Danette Matthews, back at the park Sunday, had no idea what happened the night before. It hits home because in it in it. It makes me feel like it could be one of my teenagers because I have four um, teenagers right now and I have preteens. You can see here LMPD has cameras said to be monitored 24 seven and they say the park is safe. But to prove it, we pulled LMPD crime data from the waterfront. So far this year, three assault related incidents have been called into LMPD compared to 13 over the entirety of last year. A Louisville local by the name of Cito says he heard the shots and ran to help recording everything. Stay calm, little bro. You gonna be all right, bro. You gonna be all right, little bro. He says through the chaos, it felt as if help wasn't coming fast enough. We telling them call the ambulance. The police came and literally blocked off all ways of moving out of the area. So when the ambulance did get there, they the ambulance didn't even have room to, to leave. Once they got the the kids onto the ambulance, they they sat there for like ten minutes. With all the gun violence Louisville has seen, he says better approaches need to be taken to educate people in these situations. I've been I've been shot before. I know I know one thing about well, I know plenty of things about being shot and what to do, and that's something that need to be taught nowadays. Is like gun like with all the gun violence going on, the the least they can do is teach on how to tend to a gunshot wound. Now police turn to these photos of a man they say was involved in the shooting. If you recognize him, they ask you to call the tip line 574-LMPD. In Louisville, Ford Sanders, WHS 11, on your side.